through the Kerala virtual tour and the poll conducted as part of the campaign, you have chosen Kovalam as one of your favourite touristic destination and beach destination. But more than the beautiful waves and the alluring shores, Kovalam offers one of the best village life experience, making it a perfect spot for implementing responsible tourism. As part of the responsible tourism mission, you can experience the real life activities that the natives here at Kovalam do for their livelihood, like coir making, hand loom and uh, you know fishing. So right now I am at Panathura and I am going to give you the experience of making a coir. So the first step in coir making is that you uh, you dip the coconut husk into water for about close to one year or more than a year to make it more soft so that the fibers can be removed from the coconut husk. You can see these small islands, they are actually these coconut husks that are uh, dipped in water. Uh, when we asked the locals here, I think this is close to two years that they have uh, dipped these coconut husks uh, in net in the water. And after one or two years, they're going to remove it and then remove the uh, coconut husk, the fibers from the husk and then beat it and uh, prepare the coir out of it. So it's not a simple process, it's a very long process and this is what they do for their livelihood. You can see, uh, you know, the husks, those are the uh, coconut husks that were dipped in water. They are actually being taken out for beating. Um, the people here, the natives here, they go in boats like these and collect the uh, um, husks that were dipped in water. And the next process is beating the fibre out of the husks. So let's take you and I'll take you to that real life experience of making coir. Okay, so I've almost reached here. Uh, this is not just a place where coconut uh, coir is made, but uh, people usually travel using these boats uh, to both the shores, both the uh, islands. Okay, so I'm, I'm ready. I'm going to hop out.
So I am at the beautiful village of Panathura Kadava and uh, here you can see there's a lot of coconut trees. On my left it's the Karamana river and on my right it's the Arabian sea. There's a temple behind me and there's a mosque in front of me. So this village is all about uh, traditions and mix of traditions and amalgamation of uh, all religions, caste and culture and this is where they make the choir. So right now before I move to or I go to the uh, house where the choir is made, I want to see the Arabian Sea. So I'm going to climb up these rocks and I'm going to show you how the Arabian Sea looks from here. This is going to be a difficult task but that's okay, I'm sure it's going to be worth it. Look at this view people, look at this view. That's Kovalam I see over there and we are about 3 kilometers away from Kovalam. So the shore that I see over there is the Kovalam beach. Look at the color of the waters. This is how this is what you find when you visit the place very early in the morning. It's like a greenish blue color tone for the waters. I can't see what's what's there on uh, my right because it's kind of foggy, but on my left I can clearly see the Kovalam beach. So that was my morning pill for a refreshing and I have to go and see the choir making process. So right now I'm gonna go. Follow me. Okay, so I think I've almost reached here, walking through these small passages and you can see how beautiful the place is, really experiencing the village life. And yes, I'm here. Hello. Namaskaram. Namaskaram. <laughs> So this is the uh, coconut shell, the coconut has been taken out. This is the coconut shell that they dip into the water for about uh, more than a year. And then this is taken out from the water and uh, beaten. The main reason why it's dipped into the water is to soften the fibers and it's taken out of the water beaten with an iron rod and uh, the fiber taken out. This fiber goes into a machine and comes out of this form. Uh, this is bristle fiber and bristle fiber is then uh, made into a coir that you see. This is the final product. So, any king would have done the I have asked them if they can teach me and they've agreed to it. So, I'm going to make uh, my own coir now.
add pieces of the brazil fibers to make the coir but this is not as easy as you see uh, i really can't uh, do it alone and they've been helping me thank you so much uh, cheta chechi idu korchu paniyana enikku idu ottiki cheyan pattum thonilla they are really experienced professionals who have been doing this for years and i don't think i can learn the skill in uh, like a minute or something but really respect all these uh, people who are making the coir here and you should definitely experience probably you are more skilled than i am so you can come in here and ask their help and you can try learning the skill of coir making so thank you so much thank you njan veendum verum keto ivide thank you So I've just completed my journey here at Panathura, experiencing the life of the people here, making coir, understanding what they do for livelihood, understanding the culture here, viewing the scenic beauty, and I'm on my way back to um, understanding and experiencing another location. So keep following me. So as part of the responsible tourism mission I'm right now at uh, Vellar Vattapara to experience the village life here. Uh this place the government is trying to preserve the old craft of thatching. As you know in the ancient uh, Kerala houses uh, most of the Kerala houses had thatched roofs and uh, right now it's it's changing but uh, there are some people who prefer the fusion of the modern and uh, traditional cultures. So the thatched roof is still coming into place. Uh so this is the place where the thatching is done. So let's go and meet uh, the palm leaf weavers and experience the uh, form of uh, thatching hello jeji sugana sugana ഓക്കെ ഇപ്പോൾ നമുക്ക് എന്തായാലും ഇത് എങ്ങനെയാ ചെയ്യുന്നതെന്ന് കാണിച്ചു കൊടുക്കണം ഞങ്ങൾ ഇത് കാണാനായിട്ട് വന്നിരിക്കുന്നത് ചേച്ചിയുടെ പേര് മഹേശ്വരി ഓക്കെ സോ ദിസ് ഇസ് മഹേശ്വരി ചേച്ചി ആൻഡ് ഷീ ഇസ് ഗോ ഷോ ആസ് ഹൗ താച്ചിങ് വിത്ത് ദി കോക്കനട്ട് പാം ലീഫ് ഇസ് ഡൺ അപ്പോൾ എങ്ങനെയാണെന്ന് ഒന്ന് കാണിച്ചു തരുമോ ചേച്ചി so she's been doing it since her childhood and uh, they sell this when it's completed and as you can see she's holding the coconut uh, the palm leaf with uh, uh, her legs and then kind of taking all the leaves and you know criss cross and i think it's the same way as you tie the pleats on your hair i'm going to try it now and try it okay chichi okay so you leave one leaf in between and then you take the alternate leaves and idu rendu eduthittu idu edukkanam ah idu edukkanam okay 
ആ ഓക്കെ ഇത് എന്തായാലും എനിക്ക് പറ്റും തോന്നുന്നില്ല ചേച്ചി അഗൈൻ ദിസ് ഇസ് യു നോ ദേ ആർ എക്സ്പേർട്സ് ഇറ്റ് ഇറ്റ് ആൻഡ് ഇറ്റ്സ് റിയലി ഡിഫിക്കൾട്ട് ചേച്ചി തന്നെ ചെയ്തോളൂ സമ്മതിച്ചിരിക്കുന്നു ഇറ്റ് ഇസ് റിയലി ഡിഫിക്കൾട്ട് ബിക്കോസ് യു നീഡ് ടു പ്രാക്ടീസ് ഇറ്റ് അറ്റ് ലീസ്റ്റ് ഫ്യൂ ടൈംസ് ടു ഗെറ്റ് ദിസ് റൈറ്റ് യു നോ വിച്ച് ലീവ് ടു ടൈ ഇൻ വിച്ച് വൺ ടു ലീവ് ആൻഡ് ഓൾ ദാറ്റ് അടിപൊളി ഓക്കെ ദിസ് ഇസ് ദ റിയൽ ക്രാഫ്റ്റ് യു നോ പീപ്പിൾ ടാലൻറ്റഡ് പീപ്പിൾ വിത്ത് സ്കിൽസ് ആക്ച്വലി ഡൂ ദിസ് സൊ മോർ ദൻ സൈറ്റ് സീയിങ് ഇഫ് യു എൻജോയ് എക്സ്പീരിയൻസിങ് ദ വില്ലേജ് ലൈഫ് ആൻഡ് എക്സ്പീരിയൻസിങ് ഫോംസ് ലൈക് ദിസ് ട്രൈങ് ടു അണ്ടർസ്റ്റാൻഡ് ഹൗ വാട്ട് ആർ ദ മെത്തേഡ്സ് ഓഫ് ലിവിങ് ഫോർ ദ പീപ്പിൾ ആൻഡ് വാട്ട് ദേ ഡൂ ടു ഏൺ അ ലൈവ്ലിഹുഡ് യു ഷുഡ് ബി ഹിയർ ആസ് പാർട്ട് ഓഫ് ദി റെസ്പോൺസിബിൾ ടൂറിസം മിഷൻ യു ഷുഡ് എക്സ്പീരിയൻസ് ദ വില്ലേജ് ലൈഫ് അറ്റ് കോവളം So when this is completed, it's going to look like this and this is going to go as your roof. Alright. So people, if you want to enjoy the village life at Kovalam, come to Velar, come to Vattapara and I'm sure Chechi will be there to help. She's, she's helped a lot of tourists here to make uh, the thatched leaves this way. അപ്പോൾ താങ്ക് യു ചേച്ചി ഞങ്ങൾ വീണ്ടും വരും കുറച്ച് ടൂറിസ്റ്റൊക്കെ ആയിട്ട് ഞങ്ങളിവിടെ വരും താങ്ക